whether you're a fan of the luxury brand or not, you can't deny how a Rolex watch maintains its value and even appreciates over the years. But according to Canadian businessman and entrepreneur Kevin O'Leary, buying a Rolex watch can be a better investment than gold and real estate. So join us as we uncover the secret behind this interesting thought. The pre-owned Rolex watches market has seen significant growth in the past decade. Owning a high-demand luxury, Rolex watch offers more than just the thrill of wearing it. The same watch can also bring a significant return on investment. A study by Bob's watches showed that Rolex timepieces outperformed competitors in their field and even traditional investment options like gold, real estate, and stocks. Curious about the methodology behind the study? We've got you covered. Over the past decade, Bob's Watches has bought and sold thousands of timepieces using a consistent pricing strategy that provides unique insights into the actual market value of every Rolex model. As a result, their study revealed impressive sales numbers, with surges in early 2017 and 2020. From 2011 to 2021, the average price of a used Rolex watch increased by 300%, from approximately $5,000 to over $13,000. The value of Rolex time pieces has continued to appreciate, especially since the start of the global pandemic. While all models have appreciated, two in particular have stood out. The highest selling Rolex watch over the past decade was the stainless steel Submariner, with reference 16610. The second most popular model was the Rolex Daytona, with an average pre owned price of around $30,000. It's not surprising that Rolex watches are in high demand as they are the world's most famous watch brand. What is surprising is that, compared to traditional investments like gold and real estate, Rolex has emerged as a strong investment option. Bob Swatches analyzed data from Macrotrends.net and the Federal Reserve's Economic Data, or FRED, and found that bonds and stocks performed similarly to Rolex timepieces. However, according to the Dow Jones Industrial Average, Rolex watches appreciated at a much higher rate. The CEO of Bob's Watches, Paul Altieri, stated that they were surprised by the appreciation of values and happy to see Rolex come out as the number one investment. He wouldn't be surprised to see Rolex timepieces continue their dominance and remain solid investments in the future. Despite the limited supply, the demand for Rolex watches has skyrocketed, especially since the COVID pandemic. As a result, Rolex has raised the prices of some of its top models, and this change is expected to impact the secondary market as well. The brand continues to receive immense support from fans and enthusiasts, and the pre-owned luxury market is valued at $20 billion. According to a report by McKinsey, it is projected to reach $29 billion by 2025. With the rates of projection of the watch industry, are you willing to invest in it now? Or are you going to wait and see if this is a stable rise? Stick around as we dive into the reasons behind the increase in demand for top brands like Rolex, the Demain Piguet, and Patek Philippe. Tim Strack, the founder of the platform, shares his expert insights on the topic and offers some interesting predictions for the future. Trust us, you don't want to miss out on this exciting discussion. So hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more. Rolex has started its pre-owned business and will offer certifications for watches at least three years old. The CEO of Bob's Watches, Paul Altieri, considers this move by Rolex to be a recognition of the significance of the pre-owned and vintage market. According to Altieri, stock market index funds are still conventional investments, but watches offer more benefits. He states that most people have never held a stock, but a watch can be held daily. Paul Boutros, head of watches at Philips Americas, agrees with Paul Altieri's idea that watches are a passionate product. According to Boutros, even if a watch's value decreases, you still have something you love. The secondary market for luxury watches, including Rolex timepieces, experienced a significant increase in early 2022 but saw a slight dip towards the end of the year. For example, 
a used Rolex Daytona watch at an asking price of $48,500 early in the year, but now has decreased to around $30,000 on the secondary market. Bob Swatch's CEO, Paul Altieri, stated that Rolex had been a solid investment, but even more so in the past five years. One reason for the rise in Rolex timepiece prices is the supply versus demand issue. Rolex produces around 800,000 timepieces per year, but consumer demand exceeds that. This creates a solid secondary market for pre-owned timepieces. The scarcity of Rolex watches leads to their high value and makes them a literal gold mine for consumers. Altieri says that if you find an authorized dealer to sell you a Rolex watch, it could be worth double or triple the price you paid. However, Rolex watches have long waiting lists, and people may wait years for their names to appear. According to Altieri, people who have waited so long are not likely to flip their watches. On Chrono 24, Rolex watches dominate, with 25% of searches and 14% of sales related to the brand, with 81% pre-owned. Tim Strack, the platform's founder, states that prices for most watches are still higher than in January but lower in March and April. He also says that other timepieces are stable, with a steady increase in price over time. Tim believes inflation will continue to drive up demand and prices for top brands like Rolex. Edema Piguet, and Patek Philippe in the coming months. He sees watches not just as jewelry and luxury items but also as assets that offer value stability. What do you think the future holds for luxury watch prices? Will they continue to skyrocket or stabilize? Remember to like and subscribe for more discussions on the luxury watch market. This has been Megan and thanks for watching. Stay tuned for our next video. If you want to see our insights whether the Rolex Zenith Daytona will be the next collector's holy grail, check out this next video.